I am Dave Hickey. No, I am not. I am Antonio Banderas. I am playing Dave Hickey tonight. I have to read some of these things that, that Dave Hickey has written for me. So I must be able to express in the way only I can express what I feel about this writing. In. This is called Enter the Dragon. Hey, man. I was drifting, <laughs> daydreaming, really, <laughs> through the winning moments of a panel discussion on the subject of what's happening now. What is happening? <laughs> Drawing cartoon daggers on a yellow pad and vaguely formulating strategies for avoiding punch and cookies. When I realized that I was being addressed from the audience. What did I tell you, Dave? Oh, yeah, it's Jesus. Thank you, sir. A lanky graduate student had risen to his feet and was soliciting my opinion as to what is the issue of the 90s. Preach. Take him there. What would it be in the 90s, what the issue? Tell us, Dave. Snatched from my reverie. I said, beauty. Oh, oh, beauty. And then, more firmly, I said, the issue of the 90s will be beauty. Amen. Yeah. Oh, total improvisatory goof and off the wall jump start. Free association that rose and bidding into the lips from my God knows nowhere. Nowhere. All right. All right. Or perhaps as I was being ironic. <laughs> <laughs> Wishing to sow, but not believing it likely. I don't know, but the total uncomprehending silence that greeted me. This modest proposal lent it immediate credence. Praise the Lord! My interlocutor plopped back into his seat, exuding this man out of sheer perversity. I resolved to follow beauty when it led into the silence. Improvising, I began updating Pater. I insisted that beauty was not a thing. The beautiful was a thing. It is not a thing. What is the thing? What is it, the thing? In images, I intoned, beauty was the agency that caused visual pleasure in the beholder. Amen. Amen. And any theory of images was not grounded in the pleasure of the beholder, begged the question of their efficacy, and doomed itself into in consequence. Yes, it did, girl. This sounded provocative to me, but the audience continued to sit there unprovoked. And beauty just hovered there. It just hovered. Hallelujah. As well, a word without a language. Quiet. And alien in the sleek institutional space. Like a pre raphaelite -like dragon aloft its leather wings. Amen. Amen. If images don't do anything in this culture, I said, plunging on, Jake is there. if they haven't done anything, then why are we sitting here in the twilight of the 20th century talking about them? Yeah. And if they only do things that we have talked about them, and they aren't doing them, we are. Therefore, if our criticism aspires to anything beyond soft science, the efficacy of images must be the cause of criticism. Amen. 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 And not its consequence. Right on. The consequence. The subject of criticism and not its object. And this I concluded rather grandly. 
is why I direct your attention to the visual language of visual effect, to the rhetoric of how things look, to the iconography of desire. In one word, to beauty. beauty. beauty.